Hey guys, the Patreon's still there. Get in at the beginning of the next month. Alright, let's do something that is months overdue. The conclusion to Vance J. B. The... Hmm. Vance's commission. Uh, it's, um... This one is Spyro. Uh, he wanted me to articulate the Spyro Skylander. I believe this is the Spyro from the first game, Spyro's Adventure. You know, the first game in the Skylander series, not the first Spyro game. Uh, so yeah, I basically got sent some polycap ball joints and, uh little dragon minifigure and was asked to make a miracle happen, so let's go ahead and do that. I've used these polycap ball joints before when I made the ankle rockers for the Omega figure. They're basically just these little cups and balls that you put together and they're very tiny and difficult to photograph. Uh, so what I did was I, um, I just drilled a channel into the torso of the figure and put the cup in there, painted it purple so it blends in. Uh, trust me, the purple blends in a lot better to the human eye than it does to the camera flash, so don't nitpick. And then I put the ball half in the limb itself. Um, in the case of the arms and the legs, I actually cut that little barbell thing in half and just and just stuck it into the arm a little bit because if I used the full length of it, the le the leg would come out like a like a quarter of an inch from the body. I get the feeling that these poly caps were made for much bigger figures. Um, except for the head. The head is actually double ball jointed. There's a cup at the, there's a cup in the head, a cup in the torso, and a barbell connecting both of them so the head has some range. And of course that was a couple of months ago and I forgot to take pictures of it and this thing has taken me way too long to do so let's just see the completed pictures. So here we go! It's Spyro! He has fully ball jointed, um, I, legs? I, I wanted to call them arms and legs but but Spyro doesn't have arms, he just has legs. I also ball jointed the tail so it can rotate around, and like I said, the double ball joint on his head gives you some real expressive tilt. Uh, unfortunately, these ball joints are too big to articulate the wings, which are very flat, so unfortunately the wings are static. But hey, he can still pull off some poses. He even got him to rear up on his two hind legs, that's kind of cool. Uh, so yeah, this concludes a little trio of video game characters that Vance wants me to make. Uh, yep, that's right, three figures and not a single part from a Sonic figure between them. I feel weird. Something makes me feel like I'm losing my passion. I gotta... I gotta do something. Why am I dreading work? I don't know, I guess it's because it's summertime and it's getting hotter and muggier and just the idea of doing anything is upsetting me. Oh crap, I'm still recording, aren't I? Uh, this is Wake Angel 2001, signing off.